Good afternoon, folks. This is Marius from MariusLandman.com. It's six o'clock in the morning here in Australia, and we've seen some really great price action from uh, all cryptocurrencies really across the board, and especially that from Bitcoin. This is the 28 August 2000 and update for report number 59. Now, in this report, we are going to discuss the Bitcoin and altcoin price action. We're going to look at some altcoins that are breaking out, and uh, I'm going to show you the entry plan, which are the risky zones to enter, and there are also some safe zone entries. So Bitcoin and altcoin price prediction on 24 July 2018, Bitcoin topped 8471 as expected, and since then retrace back to 6724 range as I write this report. On 23 August, we warned of the potential of a drop going into 24 and 26 August 2018 at 0.7 in below chart. So what we said there is that we've got uh, leg five, six, seven, and then the breakout leg, which is number eight. And in our previous report, what we said is that Bitcoin is forming a rising wedge, which normally is a bearish indicator, indicating that we could have a potential downwards trend. Now, that bearish indicator or the rising wedge um, has gone past the 18 day cycle, which is basically ending on 26 August 2018 and it did not have a break downwards. In this case, the rising wedge is invalidated and uh, we see that Bitcoin touched the 6593 and got stopped prematurely to trend upwards as mentioned in uh, video report number 58 as a probability. Now this basically, as I said before, invalidates the rising wedge, which was the bearish indicator, and we expect Bitcoin now to continue its uptrend. A small price jump is expected between 28 and 30 August to continue the leg number eight to the breakout as in below chart. Now we expect Bitcoin to trend upwards, round about to the figure of 7754. Now the risk of Bitcoin breaking to the downside has considerably diminished and we do not see Bitcoin breaking lower than the level where it is right now. Now we already see that several altcoins are now starting to break out upwards with uh, those being Digibyte, Neo, IHOTA, OMG, Ethereum, just to name a few. And those are all the ones that we have in the, in the Marius model portfolio number two. Now going forward from today onward, we could see more altcoins to break out upwards over the next 10 to 12 to 14 days. We expect altcoins to completely and totally outperform Bitcoin in this next move. I will start new entry positions as of today and I am going to update the Marius model portfolio later today. Now, lower entry points are now expected for risk adverse investors and safe zone entries are provided for as a conservative approach. Now, in this report, what we have, we've got this uh, much more larger falling wedge and you can see that we form basically the seventh leg and then the eighth leg is the breakout leg. So we expect Bitcoin to come back to that little resistance there where my mouse is now. Uh, that's where we're going to have a little bit of resistance and then a retracement there before we then finally break upwards towards this level, which is the potential of 9663. It can come uh, basically all the way down here just before it reached that. This level here, number six, is the 8500, which is basically a resistance line and it could potentially break through there, but then still come down, downwards on the side but we'll provide further reports and videos as we get into that leg there. Chart number two, the 18 day rising wedge, and this is the 18 days since it started dropping on, uh, I think that was at about 8 August where we identify the rising wedge with its uh, leg down. You can basically see there's one, two, three, four, five, six, and right down at that point there, is where Bitcoin started breaking upwards. Instead of breaking all the way down here, uh, it created a premature uptrend, and uh, we expect this to be the position at the moment where we should reach the 754 seven, level, breaking down there, and before it then breaks out to higher level. 
So the 18-day rising wedge cycle that started on 8 August 2018 has now ended without a break to the downside. Bitcoin got stopped at 6593 prematurely and started an ascending rising trend upwards with strong momentum from sellers not willing to sell Bitcoin at any price lower than 6593. This is the very reason the Bitcoin volume is declining and when sellers dry up, it pushes price action upwards where buyers are willing to spend more per Bitcoin. After all, we only have a maximum of 21 million Bitcoins with approximately 67 billion population and investors are starting to take notice of this fact and they will start hodling Bitcoin. From today onwards, we expect the price jump going into the end of the month of August towards 7754. And then uh, just this chart here, chart number three, the 18 day cycle has ended and we expect upwards momentum from today going forward. On 26 August 2018, Bitcoin stopped its decline at 6593 and the rising wedge is invalidated. The price jump is expected between 28 and 30 August and a strong Bitcoin price action is expected with many altcoins breaking out. Lower entry points are now expected for risk adverse investors and I'll go through that just shortly. So here you can see guys that uh, Bitcoin was dropping down here and exactly right at the end of that line there of the date bitcoin started breaking upwards that's for no reason really but for the fact that people that hold bitcoin just don't want to sell so that is what we call a premature uptrend and uh, we expect a rising year or a jump of a price movement year back to this levels year and then obviously a move up to 7754 we could potentially see a bit of a down move here before then reaches upwards now here are the altcoins that are breaking out, which is uh, you can see is NEO, Digibyte, IOTA, OMG, Ethereum, PPT, ZRX, BAT. So those are some of the coins that we actually hold in the Marius model portfolio. We're going to trade the Marius model portfolio to 500% gains and we're going to do it live. Now the exit plan and the safe zone entry plan. There's no exit plan at the moment, no need to exit the market. But what we see here, guys, is that we have a moderate risk buy zone. And this is the zone where I am starting to buy and get back into cryptos, the various cryptos that are shown you. And then here is the safe zone entry at 7159. What you wanna do is to wait till Bitcoin actually goes over that level to confirm the uptrend. But for those who are risk adverse and can take a bit of a knock, uh, you may buy here and the market may come down as well. Uh, it could even come down to the level of about let, almost there where my hand is now or touching this line here. But eventually the market is going to break up. So you're welcome to buy at that level. If you want to be safe, you can simply wait and buy there. Now remember, as the market comes down here, remember the market is going to drop here again and come back to this level here, testing this line as support. Uh, so the algorithm data show that we touch that line there, comes down before then breaks out through that overhead resistance. So again, when you buy, don't spend all your money. Uh, it's very important that you just spend about 10% of your cash and not all your money all at once. You wait and you watch for those bargains. So follow us on Twitter, uh, YouTube, Facebook, and uh, this is then report number 59 of 28 August 2018. Thank you very much. Have a blessed day.